Hello everyone, it's Mr. Son of Crix Rose and welcome back to some more San Amy. Guys, I'm sorry I haven't uploaded throughout this entire week. I've been working on the 4K special. It's taking quite long. I hope you guys don't get mad, but I really I am going to really upload a 4K special very soon. It's just taking quite a while. But anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoy this video. I wanted to drop it at least for this week so you guys can get a video out. And it's one of my stories since it's been a while since I dropped one of these stories. So guys, I hope you guys enjoy it and leave a like on it and also love and support just like you have guys done in the past. But anyways, guys, I'll see you all towards the end of the video. I'm alive. But how? Why am I alive? Does she plan to torment me until my soul is broken? Why couldn't she just have killed me and let me go? Sonic heard footsteps approaching him, and his heart sunk. Oh no! She is coming! I don't want to get tortured. Someone please help! The footsteps stopped right in front of the door Sonic was facing. Sonicu, my darling. No! 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 Please just leave me alone. I haven't done anything to you. Amy opens the door and walks in. Sonic cowards in the corner, terrified of Amy. Please, Ames. I, I've done nothing but love you. Oh, my Sonicu. You're so sweet and cute. I love you too, my love. You're... you're filled with blood. Don't worry, darling. I just had to release some stress out. That's all. Amy felt Sonic's heart beating fast. She backed away from Sonic. I bet you see me as a monster right now. I can't even say anything after what I did to you. Thing is... I'm happy because you're still alive. I was scared of losing you. Why? I'm just a toy to you. You will play with me until I'm broke into small pieces. Sonic goes speechless as he stared at Amy. You're wrong. You are not my toy. You are my true love. That's why I saved you. I love you, Sonic. All I wanted my whole life was love, Sonic. I know I don't deserve your love after everything I did to you. But please, leave me. I wasn't me who had control over my body. That is true. There is a demon who has control over her. But I'm no match for that demon. I think I can save her and stay alive. What am I saying? I can't be scared anymore. I'm going to save her. Do you believe me, Sonic Hill? I do, Amy. I do believe in you. That's right. You belong to me, my Sonic Hill. You can never forgive me, but I'm not lying when I say I love you, Sonic. There is no need for me to forgive you, because 
you didn't do anything, Ames. Sonny Q, I truly don't deserve a person like you or your love. You're wrong, Ames. You have the right to have love like everyone else. Just like I have the right to be in love with you. I love you so much, Sonic Q. I never want to be apart from you. Sonic was no longer afraid. He hugged Amy tightly. And I love you too, Amy. I will always stay by your side. You are the only one for me, Sonic. I want you forever until the end of reality. Be mine, Ames, until death do us part. Amy nods as Sonic leaned in for a kiss. Who's calling the base in the middle of the night? If it's Sonic at this time, I'm gonna kill him when I see him. My wounds don't hurt as much anymore. I hope the others wake up soon. Shadow picks up the phone call. Listen closely or else Sonic is going to die. Eggman, are you trying to joke with me? I swear, when I see you. This is no joke, Shadow. Just listen to what I have to say. Hurry up and speak. I don't have all night. Sonic is being held captive inside my base, but it isn't by me. I know how it sounds, Shadow, but you must believe me. There is a crazy murderer inside my base, running around and tormenting us. She almost killed Sonic moments ago, but she made me save his life. You will save him no matter what. Even if you're camp to find the key to immortality. If you let Sonic die, I'm going to pile your skin off and rip your organs out of your D's body. It's none of your business. What I do to my Sonic who is my business. She had stabbed Sonic in every vital area in his body. If Sonic wasn't a fighter, he would have died last night. I'm sure he's going to be tortured now. And how would I know that this isn't just a trap? You're going to have to go in blind. Sonic is being held underneath my base. You must save him. And whatever you do, do not engage in the fight with that murderer. She's extremely dangerous. You're going to have to sneak in. I will open the way to Sonic. You follow without getting caught. If I were you, I'll take an earpiece so I can guide you through alarms and booby traps. I don't think I can afford to go into this mess. But Sonic has saved me. Dang it, fine. You better not be lying to me, Eggman. Because I will become a murderer then. You're not a monster to me, Ames. To me, you're just lost. And I want to be the one who guides you to the light because my love for you. I promise to you, Ames, I will release you from the demon's claws so you and me can always be together. You and me will have a normal, happy life and we'll do whatever you want, Ames. Sonic Hill? Are you proposing to me right now? In a sense, I am. I vow to never leave your side and fight for you and your future. And I vow to forever love you. Even after death, our souls will be connected until the end of time. Because you will always be the only one for me, my Sonicu. Are you ready to be mine, my darling? No matter what, you will always be mine. No matter what, even at the end of time, I will be forever 
yours, my love. Shadow slowly walks through Eggman's base, looking for Sonic. This place is such a horrible stench. Sounds like there's a whole graveyard down here. I hope you're alright, brother. Please hold on, I'm coming to save you. Shadow! Sonic should be right through that cell door. Take him and get out fast! There's an intruder who entered my home. He shall die by my hand. Shadow opens the cell door and sees Sonic on the ground. Eggman was right. You were held here. Time to get you the hell out of here. Where is he? When I find he is good as dead. Don't worry, Sonic I will take care of the house invader and then we can go on our date. Amy looks in Sonic's cell to see him gone. She bites her lower lip out of anger. He took my Sonic from me? He doesn't know what he has just done. When I get my hands a hold of him, I'm going to rip his head clean off his body. He is going to pay for trying to separate me from my Sonic U. He is mine. My Sonic U vowed to stay by my side to forever be mine. He will never leave me. <laughs> he is mine forever. You can no longer blame me for your deeds, sweetie. I'm releasing you from our contract, Mother. After what you did to my Sonic U. You have blamed me for your actions, my sweet. When I was just a power source to you. From here on out, this is all you, my sweet. Good luck being vulnerable without my powers. Well, I hope you all enjoyed that video, and if you did, leave a like down below. And if you guys want to see more videos like this, leave a comment down below that you guys want to see more of my own stories. Because lately, I've just been doing comic dubs. But of course, I I'm going to be working on both. So this is not like, I'm not going to just be focusing on the comic dubs, but it's going to be both. So I'm sorry that I haven't uploaded that many of my own videos, of my own stories. But they will be continuing to come out. And for sure, I hope you guys enjoy them and, and just watch them. But anyways, I love you all. And again, I'll see you all next time.